JJ Altavelli. Um, you spent your summer on the East Coast in the Cape Cod League. What was it like to play against your Oregon teammates in that league? Uh, it was pretty funny, actually. Uh, the one that really stands out to me is when we played Jack Martyr's team out there. And uh, he was playing shortstop that day. And right when I walked out on the field, he had a Statue of Liberty hat, hat on. And he was just laughing and having a good time, just like he was here. And it makes me kind of miss him a little bit. Aw. What was one of the first things you did or places when that you went when you got back to Eugene? Uh, well, I only got back a couple days before we started practice and stuff, so we were living in a house this year, and so I had to get all the furniture moved in and set up cable and internet, and so it wasn't, wasn't too exciting. Um, the alumni game is coming up on Friday. Who are you looking forward to seeing and why? Uh, I'm not even sure who's coming from the old guys, but uh, I'm hoping to see all of them. I would I'd love to see Curtis if he's coming. I'm not sure if he's coming. Uh, I know Tyler Anderson and Danny Pulfer are here. Uh, I don't think Scott McGuff's coming, but I'd love to see all the guys that graduated from here. I miss them. Okay, um, you changed your number to 22 this season. Why did you do that? Uh, well, first of all, I felt like I needed to change, just change it up a little bit. But uh, it actually was uh, my senior year of high school. My dad's a junior college baseball coach in Southern California, and one of the players on his team is a good friend of mine, uh, Jordan Watanabe. He uh, passed away, and his number was 22, so I'm kind of wearing it for him just to play for him every day. It gives me a little extra motivation. That's really cool. Thank you so much.